I'm senior neighborhood reporter Bobby Portavent. Alzheimer's can impair and destroy the mind, deeply impacting our loved ones. One local woman is sharing her story in hopes of helping other people in similar situations. Cleotha Kelly tells me she shared 56 beautiful years with her husband before Alzheimer's claimed his life. She says even though the disease claimed his mind, it didn't claim the spirit within him. She shared with me this special and emotional interaction from his final moments as her husband. I walked around the building of the Delaney and when I came, I had been holding his hand. And when I came back, my daughter said, mom, dad was reaching all over the bed looking for your hand. And I sat down beside his bed and embraced his hand again, engaged in his holding his hand. And he squeezed my hand. He was a strong man. He, even to when he, he was dying, he was still strong. And he was really squeezing my hand, really, really squeezing. And then all of a sudden he just let go and I couldn't get him to re-engage. And I knew he was dying then. She was his caregiver through most of his battle with Alzheimer's. She says she always looks at life with a glass half full. Not a death sentence. It's just a change of life. She's sharing her story at next Wednesday's McLennan County Alzheimer's Expo. Eduardo Bertigay with Divine Home Care Services helped start up the expo in 2022 in Clifton. There's a full list of programs and sessions that people can attend and learn from. He tells me part of the reason for the expo is to help continue pushing past stigma. To wanted to make it open and say, hey, this is the Alzheimer's Expo. We didn't want to cover the name or dress up. The, this is the Alzheimer's Expo. And also to let caregivers know that there are resources available. Kelly says having resources and learning how to help her husband helped her through their final journey together. You can never have enough information. The more information you have, the better you are equipped to handle whatever is coming your way. Now the expo is free to attend and will be held at the First Woodway Baptist Church. We'll have more details posted online. Reporting here in McLennan County, I'm Senior Neighborhood Reporter Bobby Portavent.